Hi, my name is Amin, EMC Soft, and in this video, I want you to show you how you connect uh, Power BI directly to uh, Bitrix24 database. So there is uh, some connectors available on uh, Bitrix24, and how to use them, I will write another video. Uh, but in that video, I wanted to show how you connect um, Power BI or import database of Bitrix uh, to Power BI and create graphs which you want. So that option is more professional and uh, you have more options and you have all data from Bitrix24 to create any graphs you need. So first of all, you need to uh, create a user a read user in mysql database ask my admin to write that video and i'm showing that video now so you should do and um, i will put an instruction how we can do that that instruction in uh, in the description or on under that video and you can use it first of all you need to log in to the um, to the server where your Bitrix located as a as a root user, right? Uh, via SSH, right? So you log in there, and then you need to run MySQL. So run command to connect MySQL server. Okay, running that. Right. So you now in MySQL. Then you need to. So if you have uh, this is for troubleshooting, then uh, then you need to create a user. Then you create a user, uh, uh, just just a user for MySQL. Okay. Then once you've done it, you need to uh, you need to assign him the rights to read the Bitrix table so grant selects site manager database All right so we've done it then then you need to update a permission so so when you exit in mysql and you exit in database then you create a rule on the firewall to access the database. And then the last one you need to update. So you finished part with, um, with MySQL. Then you need to go to Power BI itself. So you need to go to your windows and before do anything with MySQL, you need to follow that address devmysql.com i will put that link in the description of that video as well and install that plugin so uh, typical installation procedure Start in Power BI itself. And so you need to um, now use uh, the same data which you uh, created here. So you need to address, uh, you need to put an address um, of your portal with port then you need to put database name a username and password for that particular user so i prepared uh, my admin prepared a file for that so you need to go again go back a bit back so you need to go could get uh, you need to go get data and select my sql database and then connect during the connection again you need to put server name which is here then database name which is site manager then 
uh, use alternative credentials, put username and password for that user. Then connect. So you're connecting. And then you can see that uh, our Power BI connected to the Beatrix 24 tables, site manager and the list of tables we got. I selected elites from uh, selected some tables with leads and loaded them to the Power BI. Okay, so you see that uh, tables is already here and you can start creating any graphs, tables and so on. So it's uh, more about Power BI video now. Uh, this video is about only how you connect uh, Bitrix tables to Power BI. That's it. Short video. Uh, looks simple but uh, our clients uh, struggle to get access to that uh, database again if you like that video click like if you got the questions about that video please put your questions in under comments in comments under that video so thank you and bye bye